Okay, this afternoon we're going to be looking at the operation of the American Baking Systems French bread molder. Um, first, to start the machine, you want to undo the emergency stop by turning it slightly to the right and it'll pop out. Press the on button, the machine will start. You hear the very quiet noise of the machine. This means it's running in the correct direction. You will see up on top, there's arrows there showing where the front belt should run. Once again, we'll start it up. You'll see that the belt is running along with the red arrow, the direction of the red arrow. Secondly, there's two adjustments on this machine. Um, first adjustment is when it's run, you wanna make the adjustments when the machine is on. This adjustment does your front rollers. It makes the roller gap and the front rollers when you degas. If you see inside, as you move the roller up, it opens up the space. As you bring it down, it shortens the space. The roller on the right, on the left-hand side, I'm sorry, this will increase the length of your product coming out all the way up. You'll get a short piece all the way down. It gets tight at the bottom and will let your thread get longer. The one other feature of this machine is it has a safety vent across the front, inlet across the front, if your hairs get too close to the rollers, the machine will shut off automatically. You must adjust this back again and then turn the machine on to continue molding the bread. One other point, when you're putting long bread in the molder, you want to take your bread and put it in long ways. And the bread then will come out the bottom longer. If you put the bread in endwise, the bread will come out short and fat. That's how you uh, run the American Baking Systems French Bread Molder.